The aim of our study is to find a new and improved means of treating psoriasis. There are good treatments available for psoriasis. The new biologic agents are actually quite effective, but they come at the price of immunosuppression and certain other adverse effects. So there is still a need for, uh, for an effective treatment that has an even better safety profile. Our study is going to examine the use of a drug called Remigipent. Remigipent is already FDA approved for the treatment of migraines, so we know that it's very safe. The study will involve a group of people, half of whom will receive the active drug, Remigipent, and the other group will have placebo, that is a pill that is inactive. Neither the investigator, me, or the subjects will know who is taking what, and that's called a double-blind study. It's very important to do it that way so that we really will find out whether Remigipent works or doesn't work. Subjects will take their pills every other day for 16 weeks. During the 16-week period, every two weeks, the degree of their psoriasis and the severity of their psoriasis will be measured. As part of the study, there will be some blood tests. Also, there will be uh, two small skin biopsies. On the first visit, which we call the screening visit, we will ascertain the amount of psoriasis you have and its severity to make sure that you're eligible for the study. Subjects must uh, be between the ages of 18 and 75. Female subjects must not be pregnant or breastfeeding and must agree to use effective means of contraception while they're entered in the study. We also ask that men in the study use effective means of contraception. Subjects also cannot be on certain medications that could interact with Remigipant. Further details about these medications are available when you contact the study team. Remigipent is uh, taken orally, unlike many of the more effective uh, treatments for psoriasis currently on the market. This agent is not broadly immunosuppressive, so it doesn't have some of the risks that are associated with immunosuppression that are induced by uh, many of the currently available treatments for psoriasis, particularly the uh, treatments for very severe psoriasis. There is still a tremendous need for a highly effective yet safe treatment for psoriasis. By participating in our study, you can help us to determine if Remigipant will serve that role. For more information, please contact us at Wild Cornell Medicine, New York Presbyterian Hospital.